Tippers, and welcome to Parent Tip Tuesday. I am on my way to get some bird toys for the birds for the holidays, and I thought I would bring you guys with me. Now, I won't be bringing the birds because, of course, I want it to be a surprise. So I thought it would be fun for us to go to the bird store together and shop for bird toys. But before I go to the bird store, I'm going to be dropping off some sniffer shirts in the mail and mailing them out to you guys. If you have not gotten your sniffer shirt, Click on the link below, you will not be disappointed. We have Sniffer shirts, Parrot Station shirts, and Sniffer's Anonymous shirts, which looks really great on guys, by the way. Really cute baseball shirts. So that's what I'm on my way to do right now. Into the post office. <laughs> well, it's clearly not the best day to go to the post office because of Christmas. I hope the bird store is still open. I went the wrong way like a few times. I don't even know why or how. It's dark now. There's been so much traffic. Oh, I want to get there and get presents for my birdies. Do not film and drive, children. Do not film and drive, okay? Okay, I'm almost there. It better be open. By the way, I tried this yesterday. You guys remember my story time Sunday was really late for two reasons. Well, three. One, Picasso ate my keyboard, which you guys know. Two, I tried to do this yesterday. And three, then I got like, I don't know what, like sick, like food poisoning or something. They better not have closed early again. Please, please, please. Okay, they didn't. Yay. All right, guys, I'm in the bird store. I'm going to do some birdie shopping. My favorite, my favorite. I'm right in the toy section right now. So let's choose a few things. It's so loud in here. There's a lot of cute birds in here. They're kind of been put away for the day because I'm a little bit late. The first thing we need to do is find a toy for Jersey. That's always my favorite because she always wants Picasso's toys because she likes bells and beads. So for example, this is like a wood toy. Not our first choice for Jersey. Let's find something with some bells. Sounds like Jersey's in the background right now. Oh no, please tell me they have something with bells for my little baby girl. Oh, oh, I found it, I found it. This is a small toy, so I'm gonna have to get a few. But these are Jersey's favorite. So let's get a couple of these because Jersey and Picasso are gonna fight over these. These bells and beads, love, love, love. Let's actually get all three of them because there's three here. Jersey, Picasso, and Cody. Now, <laughs> let's do toys with wood. Who likes toys with wood? Vinny does. Of course, we can't forget Rocky. I do have that I can make these, but I thought it would be so much more fun to come to the bird store. My favorite bird store, by the way. So, you are in Los Angeles. You need to come to Birds Plus. We need something for Vinny. What does Vinny like? Oh, you know what I just found, which would be really great for Jersey? These. A lot of you guys are always worried about cloth impaction, but if these are 100% cotton, it should be okay. But she does have stuff like this, and we need to focus on Vinny. So, do you guys see anything exciting in the background? Vinny toy. Vinny's gonna be really busy with this, so let's get this for Vinny. Oh, here's something exciting. This, guys, is a foraging toy. This would be really good for Jersey because she's a plucker. She can just pull things out of it. I know it sounds like I'm favoring Jersey, but I just love to keep her busy. If you see all these little bits, she can just pull them out and play with them. It's kind of like the way she destroys her feathers, so we're getting that. Now you know that you can order stuff on Amazon, but it's always best to support your local bird stores because you can learn a lot. You guys are asking me all the time where I got these. Here, here's something really cool for Rocky. I can't get it off, but I found something amazing. What do you guys think of this toy for Rocky? I like it. I think he's going to like it. We have Rocky covered. We definitely have Jersey covered. We need to do a little more for Vinny, I think. Um, let's 
see. Wow, exciting. Let's do this for Vinny. I love these. These have wood and rope and they're really exciting. Let's get something special for Cody. What shall we get for Cody? It's kind of cool. I always like these. I think the birds love these in general. Did I already get one of these actually? I got one for Vinny. I'm gonna get one for Cody. Let's see if we have any recommendations from the crowd here. <laughs> the crowd loves everything. The crowd loves everything. What's this? Um, yucca. Are yeah. those for macaws? Everybody. Because they, I think I got they, one. They through them really quick. Right yeah. here. If you want something Maybe like I didn't. Laugh. Something with the skin on. Yeah, this I almost got. That's I was going to ask on. you. That's the skin on. That's the inside. It's soft and mushy, you know. Do you think this would be better than for Jersey since she kind of plucks my cockatoo? Stuff that has a little bit of, that simulates the feather. I got her this. A little bit. That'll, that'll help. But you know, there's no dynamite sure cure. I know. I wish there was. Why don't I get this for Rocky? Well, he'll, he'll love that. You will leave the top string off right away. In fact, just cut the string off. Just go ahead and set it on the bottom, and the bird will just roll around on it. This is Yucca, guys. This is for Rocky. He's going to play with it and probably destroy it in how long? Mm, half an hour. Half an hour. <laughs> <laughs> half an hour. Uh, honest. Yeah, you're honest. A lot of people write to me that their bird destroyed everything in two seconds. Oh, I love that. A toy to destroy. A toy there to destroy. Go. Remember that these are toys to destroy. Your bird yeah. will eat them. But that is the point. You don't have any seeds without sunflower seeds, do you? Flowerless? No sunflower. I have them on pellets too, but... Um, well, you gotta give them a little seed anyway. They need the oil. They need the oil? You think that there is anything I should let my viewers know about bird toys for the holidays? Just buy what you can afford and expect them to have fun with them for the time that they have. Did you guys hear that? Buy what you can afford and expect them to have fun with them for the time that they have them. And I found a really exciting toy because apparently he puts the exciting ones up here. Look at this. This is going to be for Rocky this holiday. He's going to be really excited. There you go. You're going to be set. I'm going to be set. I think I'm set. Ooh, this is exciting. Maybe this will this be better. This is their Hanukkah, Christmas combined, uh, mm -hmm. Kwanzaa, uh, Everything, depending yeah. on what religion your birds are. Yeah. We just go by that. We've got an aviary, so I want to put a lot of stuff in there. Oh, good. Okay, just make sure, you know, watch your nighttime creatures and raccoons and rats and things like that. Yeah. Even in the daytime. Yeah, I don't let them out without dogs. Yeah, no, that's funny. That's smart. At least you got an alert system. Let's see what this bill comes to. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> <laughs> What's the name of your store? Birds Plus. Look at all this. That was a lot of fun. I didn't have a lot of time in there. Maybe I'll come back tomorrow. Yeah, I felt like I was, I don't know, Santa Claus. Yeah. So guess, who do you think is going to like their toy the most? And maybe you guys can help me decide who the toy should go to. And I'll wrap them up and I'll give them to the birds later and you will see if you are right. You know what? Since I'm in the area, I think I'm gonna go tanning. Well, that in the background is Rocky crying because he doesn't like the TV show I put on. I don't even shut eye or something. I don't know what it was, it was just on. That's him crying for Empire. But I wanna get the bird toys and I couldn't find my keys anywhere. And finally I found it in my pocket. So I'm gonna go get the bird toys and then I'm gonna fix the show for him. And then I'm gonna go upstairs and wrap the stuff. If you guys knew what I was using for a light right now, you would laugh. I got a lot of toys to bring in. Can you hear Rocky? I can hear him screaming from here. Like this is all because he wants to see Empire and he doesn't want to see this other stuff. That's how birds are. It sounds like I have a zoo in my house, but I don't. Or do I? He's still upset. I can't believe it. I hope he doesn't see what I'm bringing in though. Don't look! Don't you be looking at what I brought in! <laughs> I look so suspicious right now. I got all of it. Yay! This is the video for the... <laughs> I look so suspicious, I know, but... All right. Look at my doggie! Come here! Why don't 
you act like you didn't just see me? Come here. Come on, Sandy. <gasps> I forgot to get dog toys. I'm going to get dog toys. I didn't forget. I had thought about it, but I went to the bird store and I lost all track of time. And then I got hungry and then went to a vegan restaurant and someone recognized me from the channel in the restaurant, which was really cute. It was fun. Oh my God. I think I'm going to do it in the room that I often film in. Putting my key here. Evidence. See, the birds are crying, but I can't let them see the toys. But I will have to change Rocky's show right now. Okay, baby, what's the matter? Watch, guys, how invested in Empire he is. He should have a role on the show. I'm gonna call the producers of Empire and tell them that you don't like anything but Empire. He's like, yeah, do that for me, please. Got my phone. Okay, relax. Relax, it's so dark here. Okay, I got you, baby. You better hope that Empire is on this. Okay, relax. Okay, you don't like Shut Eye. Sorry, Shut Eye. I know a lot goes into making a show, but my bird is kind of picky. How about Family Guy? Do you want to watch Family Guy? You like Family Guy. He's so mad. Hey. All right. Let's see how quiet he is now. He knows the show is being changed. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you see episode nine, Slave to Memory? We're going to start early. How about Cupid Painted Blind? Let's do that. Okay. You're going to watch this episode, even if you've seen it. He's already moved up. Okay, press play. Resume playing. It looks like you've watched this. We're gonna do start from the beginning though, okay? Maybe if you know the music now, you're gonna be more excited. Are you happy now? Are you happy now? Can you guys see this? He's getting ready. I get you in a second. I will get you. Good, how are you doing? Mommy's got some presents for you. Are you excited? Yeah? Are you excited? Okay. Just let me mommy wrap this and I'll be back, okay? Meanwhile, in the world of my bird's obsessed with Empire, you haven't heard him scream at all, have you? I hear him laughing and talking. You guys probably don't know. So I got a lot of it ready. Here's the toys. Here's some wrapping. Here's my ring light. Yeah, my ring light. See how good that looks? If any of you are interested in being a YouTuber, I actually have the exact ring light in the products I love link below. So check it out. There's a lot of stuff in there too for making your own channel. If you guys are interested, you can buy some of those products and get your channel started. So here we are. I'm in the room and I'm about to wrap the presents. It may look like I'm some organized professional wrapper or something like that when you see all this or maybe those of you who are professional rappers you'll be like no she's not I'm not but just for the birds I save small pieces that I don't think I can do anything with these are for bird toys for the holidays or whenever I want to wrap stuff up for them some of this wrapping is literally from the dollar store and some is from Target and some is from last year. Birds, you can just wrap it with anything. I'm serious, like newspaper would make them happy. And the reason you wrap bird toys is because sometimes that's more exciting for them than the actual toy. I will keep tags on things and I will give them things in their wrapping because, you know, it's just like extra, you know, like more stuff that they can chew and get into. So just make sure it's safe. Oh, remember my video from <laughs> Sunday? The laptop reminder, it's still in here. I'm gonna put it away so I can stay happy. No, I'm happy. Let's take a look at what we've got. I had a hard time deciding what's gonna be for who. All I knew was that I have one of these for Jersey Picasso and I think Cody likes these. So I'm glad I have three of these. Vinny doesn't really care so much about bells and beads, but he cares about 
would. Okay, so what is this Parent Tip Tuesday about besides being a fun wrapping bird video? I don't know, can it just be a fun bird wrapping toy video? I have no idea. But if you wanna learn something, learn this. A lot of you write in to me and say, my bird doesn't wanna play with toys. Okay, I get it, that happens. There are birds like that. For those birds, you just give them a box. I'm not kidding you, like every bird without fail loves boxes. It's just like a nesting foraging type of thing. So if your bird is getting aggressive because you gave him a box that he feels like he's perching in, then you want to avoid that. But on a different note, we talked about the different toys that birds like in one of my videos, right? So let's do a quick breakdown. This is kind of like a foraging toy. You have to pull things out of it. This is really good for birds like Jersey because Jersey, instead of picking at her feathers and pulling them apart, she can get busy with all these little pieces. I think this is gonna be a really good toy. It's great for pluckers and it's great for birds that like to dismantle little things. Jersey also has this incredible talent for unsewing things. Like I swear she was a seamstress in another life. So this is definitely gonna be jerseys. Bells and beads jerseys. She cries for these. Like I used to buy these for Picasso and then she would go, hey! And she would be all over it. And then I was like, oh my God, you're a big bird, but you like little bird toys. So be aware of that. So two totally different toys, but for the same bird. Two totally different types of wooden toys. I kind of like this one because it turns, so maybe it'll give them a little more action. I think these are both going to be for Vinny, and one of these is gonna be for Picasso because Picasso likes bells and he likes beads, but he also likes wood. These are bird kebabs. They're extremely shreddable. The ultimate shreddable toy. So I'm thinking shreddable, shredder. I think the shredder should be in on this. What do you guys think? Do you think that Picasso might really enjoy something like this? If Picasso enjoys this, I might give him this one. I know it looks kind of large and it looks like a Rocky toy. I haven't quite figured it out yet because I think this would actually be exciting for Cody. I think that I might put this in the aviary and that way whichever bird is interested in it gets it and that's the way it goes because I really don't know who's going to like it. Cody. Shredding toy, bell, beads. Vinny, all wood. It's all wood with Vinny. He's just an all wood kind of guy. Real manly, real gangsta. That's Vinny. Rocky. Oh, I brought out the big stuff for Rocky. He loves bells, by the way. Rocky loves to ring bells, so he's gonna be excited about this. So we have Rocky, Cody, Vinny, Picasso. I know I have another bird. Rocky, Cody, Vinny, Picasso, and Jersey. I don't remember my birds. Jersey. Now let's go over this toy specifically. This is um, a wooden toy, but it's got like these cotton strings. If you guys are worried about the string, totally understandable. It is very important to be aware that some birds swallow things like these and cloth impaction can be dangerous. But if it's 100% cotton, it should be okay. These kind of things are great for Jersey because she loves like the little tiny strings to shred them apart. So I think I'm gonna give this one to Jersey. On to the wrapping. Now, if you guys remember, I said I'm not like an expert wrapper. What I'm really doing here is making a burrito. Why did I decide to make a video where I wrap stuff and I'm like the world's worst wrapper? Actually, I could be a good wrapper. We're talking about gangster wrap. Ugh. I need to focus, I need to be better at this. It's not that hard, Marlene. It's not that hard. And it's also not that serious because they just wanna pull it out. This is what I'm telling myself. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you a little story while I'm wrapping this. You guys know Tracy by now. She's my best friend, my blonde friend. I always say that because I make fun of her for it. Tracy decided, she's always the one that's like the best at presents and the best at birthdays. And I actually have an episode coming out where you guys can see what Tracy did for my birthday. She's like, so amazing in that manner, and I feel like so not good of a friend compared to her in that manner. But anyway, 
Tracy decided we were gonna do this whole holiday thing. And Tracy's like the only reason we do these holiday things. My sister can be quite festive too, and she's also good at giving presents and wrapping them, by the way. I'm like, what's your favorite store? Here's the gift card or here's the money. Anyway, last year we did this whole thing and we had everyone over and we all did these presents, blah, blah, blah. And Jersey was really excited by opening the presents. She loved it. She would cry if she didn't get to open the presents. So it was so cute, I couldn't believe it. I've had her open presents before, but just like the excitement of everyone being there. So tomorrow we're gonna do open the presents for the birdies. One wrapped, what do you guys think? I mean, you know, it's not like, but it jingles and it's cute. So this is one out of 12. <laughs> I'm gonna get the hang of this. I'm gonna start rolling these things like burritos. All of these things here, you can order on Amazon. I have a link down below called Products I Love. You guys should really check it out. Bookmark it, I update it all the time. I order off Amazon a lot. So I know which toys I like from there. I also have cleaning products and tricks and things that I explain to you guys in there how and why I use them. A lot of merchants put the wrong birds with the toys. You see an Amazon on the thing that Picasso loves with all of the beads that you guys probably saw in the aviary. Try not to be fooled, because a lot of things come smaller than you think, but that's why I put some details in there to help you guys out. Third one of these, should I wrap it in something different? What's different, what's different? Ooh, this is exciting. I'm just using different wrapping so that the birds are excited. I think they do get excited by having something different. Remember, you guys could use newspapers, birds don't care. They will have just as much fun though unwrapping this as they will playing with the toy. It'll give the toy an extra five seconds of gameplay. You will spend an hour wrapping things and they will spend two seconds destroying it and you will just be happy watching your bird be happy. Not only that, I must mention, a lot of these toys will be destroyed in a matter of minutes. So that's why it's important to get the right size toy for the right bird. Moving on to larger toys. I didn't even bring a scissors up here. I don't need a scissors because look at my magic fingers. Cut, 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 cut. Honestly, I'm an artist, I swear. I could be good at this if I wanted to. I, I'm good with my hands, but um, I don't know, somewhere in life I was like, what's important and what's not? I lost my festiveness somewhere along the line. No, I didn't. <laughs> Gold, this is not a wrapping tutorial. My wrapping technique is kind of like a burrito, okay? I'm awful at it, but I'm determined to make it work. So far, so good. You know what, I couldn't do this with birds. They'd be eating all the wrapping. Not bad, right? Ooh, a long toy. Well, this is another burrito technique. <laughs> How I wrap. There's some lines here that show you where to cut. So, that's the joy of wrapping for birds. They're not picky. I like to use these bags because Clearly that's my style. And if it wasn't, it better be, right? I think this gift is gonna look so good after I wrap it that Jenna's gonna want it. I think Jenna's gonna be impressed and she's gonna want this, I really do. It looks like a bouquet. Maybe I shouldn't even close it up top. Who else do you know can wrap 12 presents so fast? How are my eyebrows today, any complaints? What, I haven't wrapped this yet? What am I gonna wrap this with? This is gonna be like a peekaboo. You know, she can get excited about it. I'm just gonna tape here and here so it won't open, but it's still mysterious. Kinda mysterious, you know. It's a surprise, it's still a surprise. That's happening. Let's attempt to wrap this for Rocky. What is this? The inside? What the heck is that? I love this. I look like a real pro here. I found out what we can do with this. Okay. And then 
We don't want the birds to know the price, okay? I think I made great use of that. Man, this is a dead giveaway. Just looking at this again. All right, what do you guys think? Beautiful, right? I mean, look, what did that take all but a minute? I think I'm almost done. I have this and this. This is for Jersey. And I only have, I only have this left. I think they'd mind a gift bag. Does Rocky really need his presents wrapped? Jersey does. Jersey's more important to have her present wrapped. Oh no, there's that thing again. I'm just gonna like do that. Here we go with this top. Okay, another present, done. Then I have this and no wrapping paper, but I have this stuff. This is thicker than the wrapping paper. Why? Tell me. Oh, all right, so far so good. Let's get that other one. I swear, weren't there two of those? Ooh, look at this. <laughs> it looks like scrolls. <laughs> what do you guys think, should I tape this? Rocky likes this kind of material. You know what this looks like? A mummy. Okay, I don't know if you could tell. And then, uh, may remind you, this is not a how to wrap video. I think like for some effect, I'm gonna put this on top. <laughs> Just because I have a sense of humor, okay? And I can't wait for my sister to see my skills. Well, the good news is, I found the scrolls. Here they are. So nobody should question anything. I'm obviously some biblical figure. If anyone was looking for the scrolls, they are in my house. I'm not sure what scrolls those are, but these are definitely scrolls. And that is my wrapping. I'm pretty excited about it. Also a little embarrassed about it, but you know what? I think the birds are going to enjoy it. I'm a little scared to take it downstairs because I don't know if it's going to last. Like, I honestly don't think it's going to make. Let's see what happens. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Pretty bad, thought I did better than that. Okay, pretty bad. Not too bad, not as bad as I thought. A little peekaboo. The scrolls or the dead body, not sure. But overall, I think we're not looking so bad, you see? I think I did pretty well. All right, it's time to take them downstairs. Just to see, like, what they think. See if they're excited about it. Ooh, hope I don't trip. Don't get houses with curvy stairs there. Dangerous, I'm not kidding you. What we got going on? Ah, there's a stroller under my, not my stroller. Tracy, come get your stroller. I'm making my house festive. Oh, ooh, they're excited. Well, Rocky's been, okay. A piece of the stroller just came off. <laughs> not my type of baby. If you're wondering why it's dark, it's because my bird insists on watching him higher, which you guys know. Wilson, where are you? But he watches it on the big screen in the dark. So he's like a movie professional. He has to have the best seat in the house. I'll show you. Yes. There's a screen. Do you want to help me put these down? Do you want to grab the camera? Or? No, no. Or you could. Okay. I'm in my robe because I'm always cold. I gotta make this quick because I don't want to disturb Rocky. But I got it here. Let, let's show George my wrapping and see what he thinks. George, what do you think of this? What do you think? What is it? You don't like it? It's, it's the scrolls. It's the, the scrolls. Did you design it like... I understand what you're trying to do there. I mean, 
You ran out of. How did you wrap that? No, because I ran out of wrapping, and this was the inside of the wrapping. Oh. Do you like it? It's very creative. And then I just added color for effect. It's it's Rocky's. Oh, it's for Rocky. Yeah. Rocky, what do you think? Do you think you care for the actual wrapping? You know, I just. Think Ooh, Rocky's like my show. He thinks get to my show. <laughs> Look, he's on that. Oh, Cody's laughing. That is funny. So, so there's. Wait, these are all toys for them. Yeah. She's not interested. <laughs> She's like that wrapping sucks. <laughs> Which one's hers? Watch how she gets attention. No, you can't open it now. That's for a different day. Is this? Is this yours? Is this Jersey's? Oh, Rocky is excited. Excuse me. What's up, buddy? <sighs> what did you want? Did you come to see your present? This is yours. What do you think? It's kind of scary. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what she was trying to do here. That one's his. <laughs> he laughed. Did you hear her? No. He's like, <laughs> You laughed? So you're supposed to go into there. Yeah, but he's not supposed to see it yet till tomorrow. But I'll show you which other one is his. You should have wrapped it in uh, paper towels. Well. He would have loved it. it do you know how perfect. hard I worked on this? That's for Vinny. Oh, Vinny got some toys too. And this, this is the jersey. Jersey. Oh, Jersey, look what's inside there. Let's show her her present. She already likes it. It's supposed to be a surprise. <laughs> oh no, I didn't take the tag off. She's going to know how much it was. <laughs> That's for tomorrow. Oh, you oh, think you see She knows. Oh, she knows. Oh, she's so cute. Look at this guy. He's excited. Are you excited, Rocky? Oh. Jersey, you coming over? Oh. She's excited. Look at her now. She's like, what do you want, baby? There's toys for Picasso, too. Give me one of these small ones. This one? Let me show him. I think that wrapping scares him. This wrapping? Yeah. I think that it's kind of like a, got a weird thing to it. Yeah, it See, I knew the peekaboo would be a good thing. You like it? Yeah, it's cute, isn't it? What'd you grab? She's going to love it. <laughs> She's trying to pull it out. <laughs> Stop it. Like, where does it come out of? She found the tag. How many presents do we get, Jersey? Two. Oh, nice. No, three. She has one little one with bells. Did you get the tag? Yeah. <laughs> She's gonna like this toy. Good choice. She likes the straw more than the tag. You want more? Oh, she likes to mix them together. So that is a little sneak peek on how excited the birdies are about their presents. If you want to see the birds opening their presents and playing with them, don't forget to tune in to Storytime Sunday for part two of this episode. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video. Let's have a lot of fun. Ooh, Rocky's coming in here. Rocky, you want to say bye? Yay! Rocky wants you guys to watch him on Sunday with his present. And also, don't forget to check out products I love below. If you want to order these toys for your birdies on Amazon, you'll see all the things that I like for birds. Check it out. It's really cool. Come join Parrot Station on Facebook. And of course, follow me on all of the socials at Marlene McCohen on Instagram, where you can see the real, real behind the scenes of me and my birdies. And if you have not gotten your sniffer shirt yet, click on the link below. There are guys and girls shirts. 
and I'm not sure how much longer I'm going to have them for. So until next time, guys, I love you. Bye.